she asked him what was wrong, he told her they were all against him and he lost it and he just started shooting. We heard it from the Okmulgee District Attorney today. The murder suspect, Joe Kennedy, told someone on October 10th it would be the last time they saw him. She reported that he was very agitated and told her that he was leaving and she would never see him again. Tonight, official murder charges have been filed against Kennedy and the deaths of Mark and Billy Chastain, Mike Sparks, and Alex Stevens. District Attorney Carol Iskey detailed evidence in the case. A key piece, cell phone location info from an app used by Mark Chastain and his wife. Left a residence on West 6th Street here in Okmulgee and traveled by bicycle to a scrapyard located on 20th Street. Investigators know Mark's phone was inside the scrapyard between 5 and 6 p.m. on October 9th. But then, just before 8 o'clock that same night, Mark Chastain's phone next traveled from Murphy's USA to another salvage yard that's also owned by the defendant, Joseph Lloyd Kennedy, and is located on South 75 near Schulter, Oklahoma. That salvage yard was the last place Mark Chastain's phone transmitted any location info. Police found blood and several items near the property that they believe belonged to the men. They also located a tree which had been struck recently by a bullet and were able to recover that bullet. A black wagon was also found during this search. And when Joe Kennedy talked to police, he told them this. The defendant told officers he'd been experiencing thefts at his scrapyard on 20th Street and that he personally surveilled the scrapyard on Sunday, October the 9th. A lot of new information there. That was KOCO's Jason Berger reporting. Kennedy is now being held with no bond in Oak Mulgee County. Investigators say right now all signs show that he acted alone.